Hello guys and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Europa Universalis for the Wealth of Nations as the Luranians. Alright, um, so we're currently uh, fighting to establish some more colonies in the Americas. I'm going to use the fact that there's a bunch of natives that we can invade. I'm just going to try and conquer as many of them as possible and we're going we're gonna to get some a good colony going I think. Uh, I might also conquer the Aztecs and the Maya without actually, you know, doing too much actual colonization in the area just to get another easy colony where we don't have to invest too much in because uh, I want to start colonizing my way over to Asia because I want to get some sort of a colonial empire going over there because a big part of the new expansion is the trade companies and those are only cap you're only possible it's only possible to make them in certain areas can you make them no that's the wrong map mode uh, yeah you can actually make them in the west uh, in the yeah West Africa the West African Charter so yeah, if we can get some colonies going here, that would be very good. I want this, and maybe I'll conquer some of uh, conquer some land off the um, the Malians or whatever they're called. Uh, do these uh, match up with the trade nodes? Kind of, I think. Now, we can't see many too many of them, but I think they match up pretty good with how the trade nodes look. So yeah, we'll try and get as much power in the African area here as much as as much. There's, I mean, there's not too much value here going on right now. Um, but still, I mean, if we can get some value flowing from around, uh, uh, if, from India around Africa. Of course, I still don't know if I should collect the wealth itself in India or if I should try and get it back over to Europe. I don't know exactly how that works, but uh, we're gonna figure something out, I'm sure. But right now, we are going to be invading the Native Americans. I haven't brought all my army over, but hopefully this army should be sufficient. It's a decently strong army. Uh, so we're going to be invading uh, either... I don't know, who should I attack? Pequot or Creek? Uh, I don't know. Huron. This is Huron, right? Don't I? Yeah, I have a, an explorer, so we can go over there and just quickly see who that is. Uh, that is indeed the Huron. Are you allied to the Creek? You're not, so I might I might actually avoid getting them into the war if I attack the creek directly. Uh, so I, I think I'll declare war on them specifically, and these guys will sort of just be collateral damage or whatever. So, yeah, I think we'll do it like that. Colonial superiority. No one will join me. That's fine. Should be able to do this on my own. So, con well, it says colonial conquest, yet it says show superiority. I guess. Claim, uh, full annexation, all primitives, claim problem, rur, liberation, core return. So, you get less aggressive expansion for fully annexing people, but I don't know if that applies for individual provinces, or if that only goes for when you completely annex someone. Well, I guess we'll just learn. Yeah, we have fervor points to spend, so I guess we can invest in war. Oh no, we don't. We don't have any... Oh, well, we have... We have a tiny bit, so... Of course, I'm not funding my army, as usual. So, who joined? Oh, Pukwat didn't join. Ah. Well, that changes things a little bit, don't it? No, the... <laughs> that's so silly that the natives have navies. I, 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 just, I think that's weird. To be completely honest. But yeah, look at that. These fucks didn't join. That's hilarious. Oh, crap. Now the uh, Creeks are going to go down and take over my colony in Calif... Not California, um, Florida, yes. Well, let's go down and slap them, slap their butts, slap them a little bit. They, they, they should handle that. Really? Did you, wait, did you leave or, yeah, you left, okay. Well, that's good. I don't want you to be in a coalition against me, that's bad. No, no, now they joined. Fine, I changed my mind then. Oh, balls, they're gonna, oh, god damn, they're gonna conquer my colonies. No! God, but you don't... Don't you run away from me, you little... Oh no, I'm squishing you. You're not getting away. Squish! Yeah, the Creeks have arrived. I guess we can quickly just swoop down there and kill them. That'll give us some time until they recruit new units. Uh, it, time we can... Oh, what? Who are you? Shawnee, are we fighting you as well? Are you fighting everyone? Yeah, we're kind of fighting everyone. Well, we're fighting... Uh, the allies of uh, the creek spent some time getting into the war. I thought they didn't join, but they did. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna have to take up some serious loans in order to complete this war, because we are... 
Yeah, yeah, but that's just how it is, I guess. So let's start off by annexing these guys. Peasants War in Bavaria, that's fine. I, it's kind of interesting that that hasn't happened to us yet. We, I think that's that happens when you have no manpower, and we barely have any manpower, so... It's interesting that, I, that it hasn't happened to us yet. Let's actually make sure we get some generals in here. There's no need... Wait, where? Oh, balls. Oh, well. Really? Okay, I guess we just didn't have any locals there guarding it or whatever. But yeah, uh, let's actually... What kind of a navy is this? Uh, I think that might be able to defeat us if we are not careful. So let's try and get home. Because I want to send some of my European dudes down to kill some people in Africa. While while we're at it, you know. Uh, but I'll get this guy in there. And we'll go and kill that. Uh, so yeah, they're, they're, they're re-recruiting their arms now. But I'm pretty sure that these sieges shouldn't take too long. I don't know if my guys have too much of a siege value for themselves. But whatever. Yeah, oh, my, they're, they're disrupting my colonists, which is annoying. Just not too much we can do about that. What do I mean? Why am I doing this? This is this doesn't actually serve much of a purpose. We don't need to do that. All right, let's send him back, let's finish off his job, and like so. Uh, we have fervor points. Let's get in into war. War! Um, I don't know, should we go... Wait, are we... Yeah, we're, we're at war with you, right? So how come we can't go there? What? Why can't we go into these lands? Oh, we're not at war. Who the hell invade... Someone that is not either Pukwat or Creek invaded me. I guess it was these guys. But I, I didn't think they had that much of an army. Whatever, it will, it will forever stay a mystery then, I guess. Not much we can do about that. Yay, Hanover has converted. Convert some more. Oh yeah, we can finally convert that colony now. That is nice. Uh, yeah, this army is getting a little bit unbalanced. Well, it's actually kind of balanced, so it's not a problem. It's fine. They are noble blood though. What? Limited claim fabrication. Oh, I don't like that. I need to try get claims and more... Ooh, I don't need that aggressive expansion. I don't need that at all. Let's get some of this. Oh, that's super cheap. I guess because we're lagging behind so much. Everyone's leaving the coalitions. Well, trust me, I'll give you a reason to coalition against me very soon now. Don't you worry about that. Because I'm going to be invading all these folks. Okay, that one is done. Let's go down here and help out. Uh, okay. Of course, I haven't come up with a name for my colony yet. Shit. That's an issue. Maybe we'll just do the default one. I don't know. I'm super bad at coming up, coming up with names. It's kind of sad, actually, how bad I am. I guess I can think about it while we wait for these sieges to finish. Uh, I don't know. Like, we are a French nation, but I guess who no no know, knows nothing in terms of French? That'll be me. Uh, what do I know in French? And if I know something in French, I can't spell it, so... Oh, hooray! Stability drought, that's what I needed. Thank you, game. Stability is actually pretty cheap, though, so it's not that bad. I don't know. Um... Something really French. More specifically, specifically, you know, I don't know. But we can just name it New something, New, uh, some random province. New. Should we just be as boring as calling it New Lorraine? I think that might be just as well. I don't know though. Pick what? No, go away. I I haven't finished thinking up a name for you yet. I need to do that before I can uh, uh, annex you. Um, why am I so bad at French? I can call it something German, but I suck at German. I almost failed that 
thing. What do you call that? I don't know. Can we fully annex Creek? I don't think we... Nah, we can't. But, you know, not that far away. Are you going... Nah, as long as you're not going to take my colonies, I'm good. It's fine. Mild winter? Maximum attrition? Well, as long as it doesn't hurt my opportunities for colonization, I'm good. I'm fine. Fuck it, let's just call it New Lorraine. Let's be, let's be super unoriginal. Why not? I can't come up with anything better. Uh, that's sad. Sad but true. I'm really thinking right now. I'm trying to come up with something cool. But I can't. And there's no purpose to me asking you guys either. Because, I mean... You can't answer me immediately, and I need a name now! Should have thought about this before I made the episode, but hey. I rarely plan these things out, do I now? We can call it Trade Land. That's stupid. The Republic of Derp. I fuck if I know. Yeah, we pretty much won this war now as much as we're going to win it, so... Well, I want to occupy these provinces, because I want to annex the coasts, first of all. That is my priority. Let's get that one, and that'll be it, pretty much. We can call it... Fuck, I can't come up with anything. Fervor land. See, I don't even know what fervor means. That's the sad part. We can call it... I don't know. Why is this so difficult? <laughs> uh, oh, a Floride. That's fine, actually. Fuck it, let's just call it that. I didn't expect it to actually have a name for me, but hey, it has, so... As long as it's not like something super generic, I'm good. Sure, Florida, that's fine. That works. Alright, now we can finish the war, because now there's literally no reason not to. Full annexation. Bow balls, I didn't save a point for this, did I? So this is going to piss off the... Um, but it's primarily going to piss off the locals. The Europeans are kind of eh to it all. They don't really care, do they? I guess we can figure that one out. Let's take a random nation that have a tendency to give a fuck about my endeavors. Let's look at, like, Saxony. They currently have zero, and once I do this... They have... a glorious number of zero. So yeah, Europeans don't care that you annex land in a new world. Only these people over here do. We have two colonists. Really? We have two colonists? Really? Let's go get this one. Floride. How do you how do you ex how do you pronounce that? I don't even know. All right, let's get some annexations going here as well. Oh, hell yeah, we can annex a lot of land. Don't even get me started. How much? Oh, oh fuck! Can we annex them? No, it says we can't. We can annex a lot of land. We're gonna take a lot of aggressive expansion, and it's gonna really over. Ex well. How, can I see how overextended Florida is? I don't think we can, you know. So I would kind it would be okay, I would be, it would, bleh, can't talk. I guess it would be kind of kind of me if I didn't overextend them too much, you know. So let's ditch these inland provinces for now. And let's do like this. Of course, actually, coring these things, they don't act, that act that's not actually that difficult, is it now? No. So we can safely give them some more land. It's gonna go pretty quickly. Well, not safely give them a lot more land, but hey, we can give them... We can give them this without being too worried about them. And your money, because... Well, actually, no. You can release... Actually, why would I want to release anyone? I know your treaties. That works. Enforce anything? No, no. 
no, 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 nothing of that interests me. So I gotta make sure all of this is in the right region. Yeah, I think it barely is. Because I don't want anything that's not in that region. Simply because I don't want to have to start another... Well, I, it doesn't hurt to start another nation, but I don't intend to colonize too much more here right now, so... I think we'll be better off doing like doing it like this. Uh, where were we? Here, here we go. Yeah, I think we'll do it like that. You and all your treaties, give me your stuff. Well, you're not giving me anything, you're giving it to Florida. Bam, <laughs> holy shit. Yeah, now the locals are gonna be pissed. They are gonna be super pissed. Yeah, look at that, 100 and holy shit, that's bad. I don't know if they're gonna fucking coalition against me, but whatever. So now we're gonna stay here for a while. Um, guard some colonies. Uh, and I do those kinds of things uh, simply because I uh, I know there's gonna be a lot of revolts right now and we need to kill them because I don't think uh, Florida itself is gonna be able to deal with them I'm gonna kill the natives because they're really aggressive and I don't feel like having a lot of I mean there's gonna be enough more than enough revolts for me to handle right now so I don't need any more so I don't know if we should just I, I don't know if we should just go for taking down even more land while we're at it or what we should do but we need to make money now so we'll have to stop all this funding so here's the sad thing about these colonies though and that's the fact that they they rarely convert your regions to your religion and your culture well they tend to do religion but they're kind of lazy when it comes to culture they rarely do that but these things shouldn't be too terribly difficult to convert though it should be very quickly actually Santi, is that a... yeah, that's a, that's a colony of ours, so... Okay, there we go. Uh, rebellion... revolts are already popping up. So I'm just gonna test this. Can I defeat these without actually funding my troops? Konoi is self-sustaining? Good. Okay, so now I want to go into Africa. I've postponed this long enough. Oh shit, I have uh, run into a... oh god, we're ahead of time. Is there nothing I can spend military points on? I wish I can give these guys some harsh treatment, that would be nice. That's not how it works, is there? Military points. What can you use military points for? We can make an explorer. That might be fun. No, that costs Diplo points. Never mind. Uh, there's got to be something we can... Uh, all these other... Like, oh, fuck, fuck. I guess we're just going to have to spend it then. I, I don't want to reach my limit. That's stupid. Okay, let's temporarily postpone that. So can I defeat them? Because I don't know, do these rebels get European tech now that they are... Uh, or do they... I don't know, I don't know what happens. Because you can see how they get guns and shit, so I think they're our tech. So we'll f oh, wow, we're ev wow, why are you losing money? You are losing money indeed, yes, these mercenaries, they're expensive and shit, so we might have to ditch them. Yeah, yeah, that helps. Still though, we're barely making any money. I think we might have to kick our advisors. Are we converting anything right now? Because if not, I'm going to kick that conversion, fuck. Or especially, I'm going to kick that military, dude. He's not needed right now. We have more than enough points. So you go away. Stop paying you anything. Diplo po No, we don't need diplo points. But we need actually admin points, because we're invest... We're a lot of things we need right now is requ requires that kind of stuff. So hopefully our colony is going to be able to deal with some of this on her own, on her, on his own, whatever. Greek patriots. Yeah, that happens. Committed a ah. Oh, I want that. Well, we don't. We have a lot of prestige. We don't need any more prestige. Oh fuck! Why do we? Oh, God damn it! Uh, I don't need to lose all this money right now. Yeah, this colonial war was brutal. Good thing that making course is a lot faster now than it used to be. So they're going up to deal with that. That is good. Yeah, these uh, native rebels are kind of weak. I say that and, and then I get defeated. Really? Shit. Gain liberty desire and we gain some tariffs. Um, well... Well, here's the thing though. How much liberty desire do they get if I do... Uh, if I increase tariffs manually? It increases... Yeah, I think this is actually better, right? 
Because you get one liver to desire for one uh, tariff. Here you get 2.5 tariff for 5 liberty desire. So we're going to tax it. It's going to slightly increase the tariffs, that's good. That is fine. God, poor little colony, they're totally just collapsing. I think we might just have to invest a little bit more in our army. As long as we go positive, we can always postpone the, you know, the loans and shit. Uh, we want a guy who can provide them with diplo points, I mean, uh, administrative points, so that we can... So that they can get all these lands cored. Of course, that's not really going to stop it though, but it's going to get rid of their overextension, which is going to help out a lot. So... Yep. We should actually talk, tell them to, to attach to us so that we can go do this manually. Right, fuck, I keep forgetting. I need to get my... Need to get some dudes down to Africa. We have work to do there. Oh, you're in the wrong thing, I guess. Well, I guess we can just move the army. It's easier. Don't we have a leader? No, we don't. Okay. Well, let's get a conquistador. Conquistador. Okay, what kind of an army did we get? A ah, decently balanced one. Alright, let's send it down to Africa. We'll go to the Gold Coast and we'll kill all the natives. And then we'll colonize the place. It's gonna take a while, but I feel like it's worth it. It's gonna give us some of that sweet, sweet trade power. Yeah, I'll just let the money flow in and, uh, of course, now we should have a lot more trade power in this node. 26%, that's not actually that much. I would expect that we would have a little bit more. But why am I sending trade the wrong way? That's stupid. So now we're talking. This is a little bit better. Yeah, but in terms of trade value, this place is a hell of a lot more tr valuable than when it comes to trade. I should have rushed this a little bit more. This was stupid of me. Because it's all pretty much colonized by now. Except for this one, but I don't really care that much. Uh, so it's me, France, and Portugal who got this. That's fine. Let's just assault this. Or not. I guess not. No, we'll just stand there and siege it. Whatever. Another idea. Oh, nice. Settler increase. I like it. Although, upgraded... Getting more boats is good as well. Nah, fuck it. I want... I want more colonies. I feel like that's important. Well, actually. Oh, never mind. I th I thought... I'm so used to that being in a diplo, a diplo idea, so... I forget. But it's not... One more and we'll get a bunch of new navy stuff, which is kind of bad actually, because then we'll have to replace our army. Or navy, I mean. Which is a little bit annoying. But hey, what are you going to do? France is rocking a disputed succession again. Uh, a noble from house... Wait, is that the wrong one? No, it's the right house. But still though, how come, why is it a noble, and why don't I inherit the thing? It's because they have more prestige than me? Might be it. Could I claim their throne? No. Yeah, it might be some, I don't know, I have fuck if I know why we don't have a personal union over France. That would be absolutely hilarious if we would get that though. <laughs> that would make us uber powerful. Yeah, it's like, hey, I, I, I heard you like rebels, so I put some rebels in your rebel control territory. How thoughtful. Of course, guess who forgot his stupid navy again? That'll be me. I always forget it. At least he didn't die. Oh fuck, I didn't find my army. Can we get access to Molly? Preferably fleets? Yeah, we should be able to get that. If we get some relations up though. So, yep. And... Yeah, they will, they will give it to us. Come on out, please. I beg of you. Give me your precious, precious fleet, fleet basing rights. And I'll camp out over there. Let me fix my boats. Okay, die, natives. Are they all dead? Yes. Good. 
I guess while we're here, we might as well kill some more natives. You know, why not? I, mean, I ain't got nothing better to do. I might take this one at some point as well, so let's kill them. Hey, I found something to spend my military points on. So now these guys are dead, um, which is nice. Let's actually go on a trip of exploration in Africa. Let's just see what's going on over here. That would be nice. Learn some more, you know. We found one of the Malian armies. Gotta love the new color of Mali. It's really cool. Maybe I'll just annex all of this. I don't know. What do they produce here anyways? Green and grey. Wow, well, it's actually kind of shit. So maybe we won't do that. Is there any good trade goods in this area that we might want to annex at some point? Slaves? That's pretty good, right? Like, I guess we can look. Yeah, slaves is price high. And we have colonies in, Af in America. Of course, there's no thing in this game called the transatlantic slave trade. Which I guess is... I don't know. I, I don't know if they just haven't put it into the game or if they're afraid of putting it into a game because of, re you know... Because it's kind of a bad thing. Hey, they allow you—they allow you to slaughter natives. I don't really understand why you can't slaughter other things. Oh, whatever. Conquest against. Okay. Well, yeah, I'm not paying attention. We don't get any warnings when these guys have rebels, so. So we have to pay attention on our own. Can't I? Yeah, automatic rebel suppression. Of course, they, they don't regard these rebels as mine, so I can't... Oh, that's annoying. Bourgeoisie... Oh, this is actually historic. How the... Um, how like traders and whatnot... Uh, bourgeoisie, these are, these are like early capitalists, I guess. And basically, these are not aristocrats. So it's basically a new upper class. Uh, let's use Diplo points. It's not that important right now. Make sure we cleanse the land. Even the even the colonists themselves are rebelling. Wow. Uh, we're making good money now. It's uh, yeah, trade has been bumped up a little bit. That is nice. Not too much though. Still not making that much money from trade. I don't know if I'm doing something wrong or if I'm just not that good at. I I don't know. Or if it, I, or if you're just not supposed to make that much money from trade this early game. I have no idea. You tell me in the comments. Protestant zealots. Well, as long as it's in as long as it's in this place, it's fine. Wait, why are there Protestant zealots in Hesse? That makes no sense. I have no idea. <laughs> Whatever. Let's keep exploring. Let's explore all the things. Go on a little exploration trip. Molly would make for a great protectorate, I think. It's gonna be awesome. Trust me. Alright, killed off them. Let's go over here and do a little bit of an assault. Or not. <laughs> I shouldn't be assaulting this much. It's bad for my... Back for my manpower. Hey, my manpower is actually sort of recovering a little bit. Maybe we can even start building up our army soon. That would be nice. How did the coalitions happen in the New World? Only Creek joined, actually. That's surprising. I th you would think more nations would join in. Portugal has yet to found a colonial nation. I'm totally going to conquer this place. Great base. Well, it's actually only six. It used to be eight, didn't it? I think that's different now. Or maybe I'm just misunderstanding. I don't know. Whatever, but I guess now is not the time to <laughs> conquer more places. We are already struggling keeping the things we took. Well, I'm not struggling. My colonial nation is struggling, but that's kind of the same thing. Right, so do we get the bonuses from these things immediately? Or... Yeah, 90%. Nice. Where can we see that? From promises, 13. Really nice. And it's multiplied. It's all good. Yeah, the trade tech of the natives should be very good, so... I sh think this should be... This should work out alright. 
So this colony is going to take quite a while to get going because of the um, tropical thing that's going on over here. But I feel like it's worth it. Yeah, I think I, I want to go explore a little bit. So I'm going to build a... Can I build boats in my colonies? I don't think I can. Wait, is this tropical? It's not. We should totally colonize this place. Uh, yeah, that'll work out. Of course, we have yeah we have some troops in Europe right now, so it's fine. We haven't any had any revolts in Europe for a while, so I don't know if there's any specific reasons for that, but whatever. I'm not complaining. Right, we took the province. Let's go over and try and kill these guys before they take the place. Kill some random other rebels while we're walking there. Abenaki, is this you? Wait, hold on. Oh, fucking god damn it. Poor protectorate, really? Well, that's not good, is it now? Fuck, they took it. Oh well. They just took it, though, so we should be able to reasonably easily retake it. Yeah, I guess I shouldn't have taken this much land in one go. That was kind of stupid. But hey, what are you gonna do? Once they get the cores down, they should calm down a little bit. Yeah, but they have still haven't cored. There's a bunch of shit they haven't cored. It doesn't say how long it's going to take either, so... Whatever. By the way, can I decide how much... I can cancel it? You won't accept? What? No! Oh, come on! Did I just do that? I just did that, didn't I? I thought I could ask for it again. Now I have no power here. Shit! God damn it! Ah, crap. Really? That shouldn't be a thing. Why is that a thing? God damn it. Now I have no power here. That's stupid as well. Why don't I have any power? Oh, god fucking shit. Well, that's annoying, isn't it? Annoying and silly and everything. Should be able to ask for that again. Well, I guess now we've learned. Don't cancel that. Because you can't get it back for some reason. I, I'm sure there has to be a bug. I refuse to believe that that's anything else. We're losing some claims. That's okay. Let's keep up the fighting. Alright, get some more tariffs. That's good. Okay, so we no longer have fleet basing rights, which is okay, because we can just use uh, our colony now. Let's keep exploring. Well, it's only not that many provinces left to explore now, but still, there are some provinces we can explore. So we will indeed explore them. Because we can. Ah, oh, I hate that we can't take these guys. You see, they won't do anything. You have to do it manually. Because these rebels are not regarded as mine. My colonial nation is not strong enough yet to deal with them on their own, so... We'll have to help them out. It's only going to last a couple of years, though, before it stops. But are we the Emperor yet? Shit, we've lost a vote? Oh, crap, we've lost a vote. No, 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 no. Oh, ah, Austria has three votes now? Shit, did I elect... No, I... Oh, shit, okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Now we need to pay attention here. See, this is not good. Are you allied to Austria or some shit like that? No, but I think the time has come to secure these guys properly this time. So yeah, we're gonna vassalize uh, Bremen. I'm tired of them not voting for me. Shit, I need to get my troops back home then. God damn it, just, oh, that came as a surprise. I thought I had this shit secured, but I didn't pay attention. Yeah, look at that, it's Magdeburg. They are now voting for Austria of all nations. Not, Austria's been building up their strength again, haven't they? I haven't, I have not been paying attention too much in you. Yeah, you're, uh, Austria's conquering Hungary. Together with the Ottomans and Ukraine. Your, Ukraine has also had a little bit of a comeback. In general, uh, a lot of nations are doing stuff, which is bad. Because I shall be the emperor. Let's get on the boat and go, but go home and do some vassalization. I guess you can't trust these princes to vote for you. Right, Bremen, it's time that we talk a little bit. Cancel that. We will cancel the guarantee. 
It's gonna piss them off quite a lot, but... Oh, I don't care. I just don't. Am I gonna break our alliance? We're just gonna break everything, really. Oh, crap. No, fuck this. I can't. I have no money. I'm poor. I need to pay loans and everything. Uh, yeah, let's get a guy over in France, actually. Yeah, I have, I have sort of been not paying too much attention to Europe lately. We need to do that more. It is important. Also, I need to build more of a navy. I can build a lot more now. We need to build more trade ships to get more trade power. I think that's going to help our income a little bit. I'm going to wait. A, I'm going to wait though until I get that new diplo power, uh, diplo tech. Uh, okay, solve that alliance. Oh, that really pissed them off, didn't it? Yeah, now they get that want your provinces modifier. God damn it. I think I'm just going to take the uh, stability hit from um, declaring on a nation which you have a royal marriage with. Just because. Just because I don't want to lose that. Because there is huge relation penalty to uh, cancelling a royal marriage. So I don't want to deal with that right now. Right, I don't think I need... Nah, they don't have too many allies. Who is this? Versburg, are you an elector? You're not. I need to I need to take Magdeburg and Bremen. I need to make them vote for me. Who is Magdeburg allied to? Where is Magdeburg? Here's Magdeburg. We have barely bordered them. Yeah, they don't they don't have any allies either, so I think we can actually declare war on them both at the same time. Of course I don't have any Casa Spelli though. Which is annoying. Can I make a Can I do anything to give a Casa Spelli? No, I cannot justify a trade conflict. God damn it. Oh well. That's fine. We might just invade um, Lunaburg. They have some scary allies though. I don't like that. Bavaria, Magdeburg, and Ulm. Oh yeah, so Saxony. So I can I can fabricate a claim on these guys. And that'll give me a castle spelly. That'll also involve Magdeburg. So yeah, I'll do, I'll do it like that. Uh, do I have a castle spell on you right now? I don't. I have a truce? How does that work? What? No, I don't have a truce. What are you talking about? Seriously, what the F? I have no truce with you. I have access, though. I have a couple of those things. We need to fix that. Cancel the access. Uh, let's fabricate a claim so we have a castle spell. And I need to pay attention in America to kill the rebels. Yep, that'll be it, I think. Yeah, all right, good. Good, good, good. But seriously, why are you talking about a truce? Who, I have, who do I have a truce with right now? Bremen. What? I don't. Ah, you gain a truce when you revoke your shit, don't you? Ah, oh, smart little game. Who knows what I'm thinking? The game is a douchebag. Shit, that's gonna give the throne to Austria! God damn it. Ah, shit, I don't need that right now. I need the throne. I want it. I demand it. I require it. Oh well. Okay, how are, how are your cores coming through? No, oh, you're working on it. You're getting there. It's just that I, they don't have much in terms of power, so. Yeah, I should probably have just annexed these guys in the start and waited with the rest of it. We have lost colonialism. Is that so? Why? Ah, New Portugal is a thing now. Okay. Well, that's fine. New Portugal. But I really hate this. Because it's really difficult to... Oh, fuck. That's a thing as well. Colonial, colonial nations will also make protectorates out of these natives. And I need to make sure I conquer them quickly enough so that uh, stupid Florida won't do anything stupid like that. But I'm going to wait until they finish coring before I do anything. Uh, we can get some more units. Okay, cool. Uh, let's get some American infantry. That'll work. Right. Uh, yeah, lower that even further. It's not that important anymore. We need money. 
not making as much of trade anymore. I don't know what I can do to optimize that. So we get this kind of trade into Antwerp and... Yeah, the vast majority of trade is actually going to Antwerp right now. But it means that not a lot of trade is actually leaving the new world. Yeah, I'm super not powerful here. I don't get this though. I have no... Yeah, so... Yeah, I think we'll be better off changing this guy. We'll put him over here where we actually have a little bit of power. Yeah, I think I encountered a bug. These guys should be giving me power, but they are not anymore, I think. Because I, should, I shouldn't have 1% power if these... Is this suppo isn't, aren't colonial nations supposed to give you half their power? Clearly, Florida is not giving me that kind of power. And I can't save... I can't reload my save either, because this is, this is Iron Man, so... Yeah, that's annoying. Okay, let's take this guy and put him over in the new world. Just to make these things a little bit less brutal. So our claims have come in. We are getting ready to invade. So yeah, we'll fight Saxony. Maybe we, maybe we will even conquer this thing. Just to... Yeah, I think we'll actually just do that. What the hell? I can handle it. We need to expand. We need to become stronger, you know? But yeah, we need France's help, though. We can't do this on our own. Yeah, France will indeed help. So France should be able to deal with a lot of this shit. So let's fund our army, retreat a little bit. Well, I just want to make sure I get the siege over in uh, Magdeburg. So I'll just rush that, I think. So that's the most important. Fuck, oh f oh, when I think about it, we can't actually do it immediately. We have to wait until I, I need to convert them first. Maybe they're small enough so that I can do both in one go. How, what, how wealthy is this? Oh fuck, it's 10. Well, I guess we won't be doing both at the same time then. Because that's a lot of wealth. Uh, it would well, uh, maybe we'll actually be able to do it. I don't know. Wait, hold on. Of no, 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 no. This is not right. Oh shit! The game really does not want me to have the to be emperor. I know, don't know much, but that is true. That is true. Lorraine is not the emperor. Diplomatic relations. Ooh, that's good actually. But well, I'm gonna eh, postpone it a little bit. Just in case I need to cause some serious shit. Right, fuck you, Mr. Saxony. It's time for you to die. Go. Uh, no. I don't like you, Hansa. You're dumb. Really, you're attacking me? You better not attack me. So exactly are we fighting now? Yeah, we're fighting a lot of the HRE. That's what you gotta do, you gotta fight the, fight the HRE to, uh, you know, gain control over it. Uh, I'm kind of afraid that the Austrians will get too far in these reforms before I get to claim the Emperor, or the throne, I guess. And that'll be bad. So where are the French exactly? Durban about down here, fucking sieging Ulm, really? You couldn't come up with anything better to do. Haven't you got some enemies to kill? Stuff to do. Yeah, okay, now they're doing good. It's fine. Okay, we have a mission now. Have we converted all our lands? We have. Nice. We have 100% religious unity. That is sweet. I think the vast majority of these armies are dead now, so... I think we can safely start splitting up and sieging. Once more, we need to pay attention in America! Or maybe not. Nah, they're getting cord. Yeah, they're finishing off their course, and they're actually they actually have claims on different stuff. That is cool. Here's the thing though, can we annex this land if we go to war with Portugal? Who is this is this, is this a protectorate of Portugal or is it a protectorate of New Portugal? It's just a protectorate of Portugal. So that's okay, I guess. But yeah, I think we need to change our focus, because it seems like uh, New World Nations are bugged at the moment. Because I'm not getting any trade power from the... Um, 
I'm not getting any trade power from these guys. I'm only have, I only get 1% and I should be getting a lot more. So I, I, I guess it's really, really good that we did not make these ones into full colonies. Or yeah, make it into a colonial nation. So I guess we can build some buildings here to try and get some power, to get some money out of the new world, but... I don't know, I feel like it's limited exactly what we can do. Uh, but yeah, I think I'll end this episode here, so thanks so much for watching and until next time, bye.